Whoa, Delilah, there's a big chain link fence between me and the meadow. I, I don't think I can get past it. Uh, a fence? Yeah. How big? Big. It goes off in both directions. Acres. But what the fuck is going on out here? Whatever it is, someone doesn't want anyone to know about it. Sometimes biologists will cordon off a little area to study flora or whatever, but that's only a few square feet usually. That's not what this is. <sighs> well, see what you can do to get past it. Looks like goddamn Area 51. Maybe they've got aliens. That'd be exciting. Yeah, we'll see about that. And what are the odds they left the gate unlocked? Pretty low, I'd imagine. Um, I've, I've given it the good college try. I know that. Oh, shit. I, I don't know how long I can dick around out here until someone notices. God, if you were an actual firefighter, you'd have that gate down in two shakes. Hey, actually, those guys doing the controlled burn, they might be able to help. Where are they? Beyond Ruby River, there's a scout camp. They burned a line a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Well, that's great. If they haven't left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. Hey, I called around. Things seem normal with everyone else. Should we call the cops or the forest service and, and let them know this is going on? Um, don't you think that would sound, you know, crazy? Yeah, it is crazy. We have to tell someone. Tell them what? Henry, tell them we're being stalked and you were attacked and we don't have any proof? I don't know. Tell them we're being bothered or something. Henry, I really like this job, okay? And if I give off even a hint of cuckoo to my bosses, they are never going to let me come back out here. Do you understand that? All right. I'm headed toward the camp anyway. Okay. Keep your radio close to you. Hey, what you just said, keep my radio close to me. Yeah? Before I got attacked back at the lake, I saw a radio on the ground, kind of like the one I use. And? Do you think that maybe someone was, you know, uh... I don't know. What? Maybe intercepting our frequency with other radios or something. 
just a thought. I, I don't even know how you would do that. Yeah, well, you sound worried. No, I'm not, okay? Let's not spin out of control. Just keep hiking. Whatever you say, boss. his dad to protect him. Ned, right? Yeah. You don't think he could? No, you're you're probably right. It, it was three years ago. He's in high school now. He's on summer break. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Oh, the June fire isn't going anywhere, huh? No, that's why those guys came out to burn that line. It's at the stage where all we can do is pay attention to it. They're not going to try to put it out? Not yet, apparently. Whoa, Delilah, the trail I hiked in on, it's, it's, uh, it's gone. 
What is this, the Twilight Zone? It's starting to feel like it. Well, look, don't freak, okay? This happens. At the end of the summer, we just fly you out. Or, you know, if there's an emergency. I'm sensing an emergency. I can't call and ask for a $15,000 helicopter ride because there might be someone out here harassing us. Well, let me know when you can, okay? Okay, Henry. I found where they did the controlled burn. I can hike right through here now. Yeah, normally they wouldn't do that so close to a body of water, but I think they're extra worried about a fire jumping the river and burning up to two forks, now that there's someone in it. Well, I'm extra appreciative of that. Let's see, the scout camp is southeast of the river. There should be a pond on the way. There's some old snowmobiles out here. That's crazy. Looks like one of the poor bastards was cruising across this pond and dumped it. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. Uh, there's an old pond out here, not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Ah, uh, yeah, I know where you are. Yeah? Where am I? Pork Pond. There used to be a sign up for it, but, um, well, folks kept stealing it. Whoa. Someone stripped these snowmobiles down to the bone. <laughs> uh, because it's called Pork Pond? It's a good goddamn name. That sign would look great in a den. Or, you know, anywhere.
bridge to the camp is out. Damn. I'm gonna walk the ravine and see if I can find some high ground to get across. Good plan. Camp Arapaho. You're there? Yep, yeah, I am. <sighs> it's been out there since the 50s. I was never really into the idea of the scouts. It's something about men organizing boys around their ideals. Never sat right with me. Beware of weebelos in large numbers. Beware of anyone in large numbers. strong enough to climb back up some of these drop-offs, but here I am, stuck. Yeah, well, we've all got our limits, Henry. Uh, I guess these little shelters are where they keep the weeblos. For the past 35 years, yeah. You ever talk to any of the scouts? No, they haven't been out here in a while, and I generally don't have a lot to say to preteens. Unless it's Brian Goodwin. Well, if forced, I mean, I can make conversation with anyone. Plus, it was sort of fun to hear about all of his nerdy hobbies. I mean, he, he wasn't a scout or a weedle or whatever? <laughs> I got the sense that boy could barely tie his shoes, let alone a clove hitch. Yeah, these guys are gone. I found where they were sitting around before getting picked up. Damn. Hmm. Hey, D, that... left something behind. It's uh, like a memo from their boss. Did it say anything of note? Uh, next few days, dropping into the thoroughfare on behalf of Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Wapiti Station? Holy crap. Keep reading. Oh, I just thought I would maybe, you know, stop there, let the mystery percolate. My mother always said I would need someone to give me a taste of my own medicine. They're running a research site out there. Uh, he was worried about wildfires. Someone is writing down our conversations. And now we find out there's a research site out here that, that, that we don't know about? What are they researching? I think they're studying me. Because of what happened to you before. Everything with Julia. Yeah. Maybe they're studying the effects of... Something like that? Grief? Grief when you have no other choice but to be alone with your thoughts? So they set up an entire site just for you? Maybe. Oof. I think we should allow for the possibility that this is all just a big misunderstanding, but... God, if you saw what you said you did... Fuck, Henry. Yeah, I saw it. Okay. So what's next? Well, I've got an axe, so I can figure out a way to get over the ravine and back towards the site. Sounds good. Check in when you can, and keep an eye out for anyone following you.
thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed. Or you are, at least. Where are you right now? Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. All right, so uh, tell me what you think of this. Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Oh, oh fuck. fuck. Um, there isn't any way someone, like another lookout, could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. And what about when I heard you talking to someone else? I just left your line open. That's not what this is. Get in your tower. Shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I'll call you. Understand? I will call you. Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. The June fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? Uh, you can do me for a trip out of here. I don't care if it's on horseback or a helicopter or in a canoe. Just get me out of here. Henry, we have work left to do. Let's chat about what's bothering you and you'll feel better. Are you serious? Let's talk. Okay? Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Sure. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. It's, it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Oh. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there.
I'm here at Cottonwood Creek. You see the cash box there? Uh, it must be around here somewhere. It is. Find it and open it. I changed the code. It's 5678. Are you kidding me? I was in a rush. Got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Hopefully. Holy fuck, Henry. We have to get into that site. What the fuck is going on? People are listening to us? I don't know. Our radios are tapped? Are you fucking serious? Our radios are definitely tapped. That's why I left you the one you just got. How, how, how is this even possible? I don't know, Henry. What do you know? I know that I'm scared. Are there any other lookouts this is happening to? Someone else in on this? Anyone? <sighs> this is just happening to us. Everyone else is fine. Are you sure? Yes. I've tried to bring it up to Chimney Rock, Elk's Fork, and Beartooth Lookout, and every one of them got confused. Asked me if I'm okay and if I need to be relieved. Our fucking state coordinator asked if I was just having lady troubles. So no, this isn't happening to anyone else, and I'm done asking. None of it makes any sense. Who is doing this? I don't know who could be doing this. Henry, I've been at this job off and on for 13 years. Sometimes here, sometimes over near Jackson, a couple times down in Wind River. And nothing like this has ever happened before. I just changed clothes laying on the floor because I don't know who could be watching. Look, I'm headed back to the gate, and now that I've got an axe, we'll know something soon. You need to get into that site. Call me when you find something. of something not, um, not great. What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls, the ones that went missing a few weeks back. What? Why would you do that? I told you to say the minimum and just keep it vague. I just didn't want to be hassled. And now someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. And I've filed a report that's a blatant lie. Oh, and those girls are still missing. Yep. Fuck, Delilah. Fuck, indeed. We really need to get to the bottom of this.
I'm busting the gate down. There's nobody around, and it's the quickest way in. Copy that. <sighs> Smashed open the gate. Should I try to fix or hide this? No, screw it. Okay then. Oh! Ow! I got stung by a bee. Yeah. Did it did it hurt? Yes, kind of. Uh, okay, I'm I'm sorry. Sight. I don't see anybody around. Lucky for us. Yeah, lucky for us. B, there is some serious comms equipment out here, wireless stuff. What do you mean? I'm talking a big 20 foot tall transmission tower. And they could probably listen to whoever the hell they want. They're nestled down in this valley, which makes it impossible for you or any lookout to see them. doing something with the soil out here too it's all gritted off uh, who knows what else they're up to I'm in their main tent what's it like it's definitely some sort of monitoring station this place sleeps three they've got a row of cots here so they live in work in the same all one operation <laughs> like us yeah like us i found their main monitoring desk oh my god what do you see seriously at this stage i'd believe just about anything there's a box here with a dial it has a needle like it measures earthquakes you mean like a lie detector yeah i'm not sticking around to get hooked up to it there's some sort of monitor i don't know what it does maybe air quality or something maybe they're keeping data on everything that could impact our moods I mean, this stuff looks like it just got lifted out of the space shuttle. I have to tell you, if I found out this was NASA, I'd be a hell of a lot happier. Well, they're measuring the barometric pressure, too. Why? Okay. Shit. Got a map here that confirms they're tracking my... our... people's movements. The map's got all sorts of paths and areas marked off on it. There are lines that look like some of the paths I normally take. Are you positive it's you? I'm not sure, but I think so. Okay. okay. So there's a log here that tracks the movement of four distinct subjects. You and me? Uh... Yeah, definitely me, and I suppose you too. 
what about the other two? Maybe the missing girls? Like, they're still out here and these people are following them? Maybe. It's possible, right? But then why haven't you seen them? I, I, I don't know. We'll talk this over and figure out how to get the hell out of here. I just I wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. And they know you're there, so see what you can find and get out. I think I found the thing they used to track us. Holy shit. You know, you swear, like, a lot. Not the time, Hank. Anyway, it's called a wave receiver. Looks like it picks up anything that emits a signal. It's got basic orienteering capabilities, everything. Holy. Holy shit, Henry. Yeah, holy shit. You're gonna take it, right? Yeah, of course. Uh, okay, this thing is losing its mind, beeping like crazy. I can hear it. What, what's it after? I don't know. I'm gonna go find out. I mean, there is all sorts of contraptions and shit out here. This equipment is not stuff from the hardware store. This thing is responding to something in this pile of crap on the desk. Dig through it. Are you shitting me? What? What is it? There's a folder of reports here. What do they say? Their assessments about the two of us. There's stuff in here about Julia. Like what? Stuff I didn't tell you. This is... What, it, what does it say about me? You said there was one about me. And it looks like they've been following me around. What I do when I'm out hiking? Jesus! Henry, do you hear me? It says that you, you and your boyfriend are still together. What? We're not. They're messing with us. Yeah. Okay. They are. How do they even know who he is? How the hell does this... Of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down. Yeah, fuck them. We'll dump an ocean of water on it, and these assholes will spend the rest of the summer picking up the pieces. We get to finish out our contracts. <laughs> Hell, we'll even call in the fire. Yeah, okay. You don't sound too excited about that. I'm not. Look, worst case scenario. firefighter dies trying to put out what we started and we live with that on our conscience for the rest of our lives <sighs> Fuck. yeah worst case well maybe it's not the best idea yeah it's definitely not the best idea ah so fucking wound up 
it's all right. I'm just going to hike back. We have the wave receiver, and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. climbing out of here and um now it looks like there's smoke coming from the site what the hell happened to you it's definitely not the best idea it wasn't me <sighs> what do we do we just call it in like any other fire and what about who started it what about them uh, the person who started it yeah we're talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us I, I, I don't know what to do about that except get the hell out yes get us the hell out of here I will receiver just picked something up like a signal it's going beep beep yeah what could it be i don't know you gotta find out all right i'm on my way now you know what i just picked up uh no a fifth of major bueno tequila from the creek are you drunk no i am getting drunk don't do that I know, I know. Everything has gone to total shit, but you gotta live a little. You gotta allow, Hank. No, no, you're right, V. I can't think of any good reason why you wouldn't want your decision making inhibited right now. My thinking is I could stay up all night worried I'm gonna lose my job because of the side fire, or I could not worry and let the chips fall where they may. It's not like there's any proof we were down there. My thinking is I'm going to follow this wave receiver. Ooh, I like it when you think. Ay ay ay. I'll just leave you alone with whatever these thoughts are. See, I, I found some sort of supply bag, light camping gear, some clothes, and basics, but it was alarmed. I think that's what was making the receiver go haywire. You're okay? It's not a trap or anything? Yeah, I'm fine, but there's... There's also a set of keys here. I don't know why they'd be hidden out here. They say Shoshone National Forest, Cave 452. Is that the one in the canyon? 
Yeah, it is. <sighs> Who the hell took them? And what the hell is in that cave? Okay, okay, let's just think. Says the woman with the half a bottle of tequila in her belly. Maybe they're panicking and we're preparing to beat it. The fire hasn't spooked and we have new walkie-talkies, so we have the upper hand. Yeah, well, it's hard to feel like you have the upper hand when you're standing in the dark in the middle of the woods. Oh. Well, you're back in your tower. Maybe you need a drink, too. I'm not in my tower. I am looking at a man standing in your lookout. And it's not you? It is not me. Oh my god, go. I'm going. I don't see anyone up here. She was just there. Huh. Left a cassette player taped to my damn door. Uh, I don't even know what to say to that. Well, let's see what's on it. tape of us talking down at the site. It sounds like it was recorded from somewhere nearby. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, and it sounds like we were the ones who burned it down and that it was your idea. No. We are screwed. No! Dee, just don't freak out, okay? Don't freak out. Oh my God, what the fuck is happening? 